Man, I can't believe it's December already. This year went by so fast. Yeah, I feel like it was like 12 months or something. Uh, because it was 12 months. That's how a year works. Oh yeah, that's right. Anyway, since it's December, you know what that means, right? Tax season's just around the corner? Uh, no. And why would you be excited about that? Who doesn't like contributing to the improvement of the current economic status of our country? What I meant is that it's Christmas time. Oh yeah, tis the season to be jolly. Ho 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 ho. Mm-hmm. And that means it's the month season. Yes! But what is that? I've never seen that in my life. What? You've never had tamales? Please, please don't hit me for being ignorant. I promise I'll change for the better. Just please, please don't hit me. I'm not gonna hit you, Chris. Are you really that scared of me? Kind of. I should probably stop hitting you then. Really? Nah, I'm not gonna stop hitting you. Anyway, come with me, my little virgin tamal friend, and I'll teach you everything you need to know about tamales. Okay, Chris, this is a tamal. Tamales are a traditional Mexican dish layered with masa, dough, and often filled with meat like pork and chicken. But there's also tamales made with cheese, fruits, vegetables, and pretty much anything else you can think of. Oh, so like a jelly-filled donut, kind of. Uh, no, not at all. Anyway, all of this is then tightly wrapped in a dried corn husk or a banana leaf, where it's then steamed in a big pot. That actually sounds really delicious. Can I try it? Yeah, of course. No, Chris, you don't eat it with the husk. You take that part off. Oh. Oh, it's pretty dry. You're not supposed to eat the husk. You're supposed to take it off like this. So it's like opening up a present. Yeah, exactly. That's actually all my mom gave me every Christmas. Instead of unwrapping gifts like everyone else, I was stuck unwrapping tamales. That's pretty sad. Eh, it's whatever, cause tamales are delicious. Try it. Ooh, yeah, that's good. They don't call it the solution to world peace for nothing. So why exactly is there a factory line going on in your kitchen? I'm pretty sure there's labor laws against this. They're making the tamales, Chris. And growing up in a Mexican household, you're probably gonna be forced to make tamales at some point. So why are they making so many? There's like a hundred already. Oh, yeah. That's enough for probably like two people. Two people? Yeah. Well, damn. Oh, mijo, I didn't see you guys there. But since you are here, you can help me make tamales. Oh, no, I'm okay. I don't believe in forced labor. I said, come help me make tamales. Uh, 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 okay, coming. What is up, Gorilla Gang? Hope you enjoyed that video. If you liked it, make sure you give a big like. And let us know in the comments down below, what type of tamal is your favorite? My favorite is pork. I like the green chicken one. Mine are the banana leaf mole. But let us know in the comments what is your favorite one. And also, guys, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. And you see that bell button right there. Mm -hmm. Make sure you click it so you can be notified every time we have a new video, guys. And also, guys, make sure you go so oh, follow Javi. Go show him some love. Link is in the description. What's your Instagram, dude? Hav Casanova. Link is in the description, guys. And uh, with all that being said, click right here to check out behind the scenes. Click right here if you aren't subscribed yet. And with all that being said, we'll see you guys next time. Hey, and if you're still watching right now, comment down below. Tamales.